G'day, Adam here from Walk the World 360. Uh, today we're starting a new series, which is just Discover Victoria, local locations. Uh, we're doing some water skiing, some wakeboarding, and some tubing. And we're at Little Lake Bort. B-O-O-R-T. Look at all this great stuff, Lise. Cool, personalized plates. Barclay, Barry, Bert. Bort? Oh, come on, Bort? Mommy, Bobby, buy me a license plate! No, come along, Bort. Are you talking to me? No, my son is also named Bort. So it seems like a pretty good holiday destination. You got your tennis courts behind me, some warm bowls. There's a huge park area with lots of barbecues places to have a picnic and lunch. Beautiful green grass, so we're here in the middle of summer. There seems to be like a whole bunch of like just walkway right around the lake. So just to show you what the lake looks like, this is the lake here. So it's about a three kilometer right round. So as you can see, that's what Lake Bort looks like. Pretty small, nice little boat ramp, and there's the boat ramp behind that you can see. And then just behind me is the boat ramps right here. Uh, just behind me is the caravan park. There's the playground, the barbecue, and the water. So now we're just driving through Bort. Uh, as you can see on the left hand side is those tennis courts and the lawn bowls court that we spoke about earlier. Uh, we're just about to drive through the town centre. So there's a home hardware which you can see. More importantly there's the local pub. Uh, one of two pubs in Bort. Uh, yep, there's the Home Depot again. Uh, just on your left here you can see there's that local cafe. That's one of the best cafes in town. Uh, there's the local IGA, that's the only supermarket, followed by, of course, another pub. Uh, and then just keep going through. This is just the rest of the town. And that is the entirety of... So that was our day at Bort. Uh, if you enjoy like getting on the river or getting on the lake and having a bit of a ski or even just have a swim with the family, it seems like a pretty down good spot. Uh, it's about two and a half hours out of Melbourne. And yeah. Not a lot of people will probably be there unless you're in like the peak seasons. Um, thanks so much. I'm Adam from Walk the World 360 and I'll see you on the next uh, Discover Victoria. Cheers.